Well, hello, Achievers. I'm Brandon, and let me be the first to welcome you to the new year. Maybe you are a longtime customer, or maybe this is the first time using the Key to Success planning system. Today, guys, I'm gonna show you how to install your OneNote version of our planner using an Apple computer. Yes, Achiever, you are about to embark on the first steps of getting started with your success. First off, we want you to go ahead and click on Training Support and go to Installation Guides and go over to OneNote Installation Guide. Please note that there is two methods to installing the planner. One is the Open Notebook function and the second is using the Microsoft Importer. The OneNote function, if you have a Windows device or you are using SharePoint, that is the preferred method. If you are using an Apple computer and you want to install our system, the OneNote Microsoft Importer method two is the preferred method of starting. This works best for those that have personal accounts that you want to install the planner. By all means, if you're using a business or executive edition of our planning system, you can still use method two to import into your personal account. For those of you that have a SharePoint account and want to use our planning system on an Apple computer, please go ahead and send us an email for further instructions. But if you are using a business or executive version of our planning system, you can still install it on a personal computer. And right here, you will find that information for the email to get started. I encourage you to take a minute and to go ahead and read through these instructions before you get started. Also note that we've updated the upload time for our system. Now that you've taken a minute to go ahead and read the instructions, we're gonna go ahead and we are going to download our planning system. You should have got an email address that says, thank you for shopping and by all means, thank you for taking a minute to invest in our system. We know it is one that has brought a lot of people success. We hope it brings it to you. In this order confirmation email, you're going to see the product, the expiration date. Please note this expiration date is not a date that your planner will expire, but a date that the download will expire. And if you ever need additional downloads, maybe you are switching devices, switching accounts, and you wanna go ahead and download your planning system again, please send us a message and we'll happily extend that for you. But we are gonna go ahead and click on this link to download our planning system. Now this is a unique download link for you and your license of the planning system. This will go ahead and download. When it downloads here, you're going to see on an Apple computer, it's going to extract the file for you. And you're gonna see 2023 key to success and then the addition name. This may change for individual users. You're also gonna find in there a folder. One is going to be a Monday start date and one is going to be a Sunday start date. And you can see there's additional folders inside these folders, but we're only gonna focus on the root folder. So the first thing you need to ask yourself is do I wanna use a Sunday start date or a Monday start date? Then jumping back over to our website, we are gonna go over to step two. This is best done from Microsoft Edge or a Google Chrome browser. We're going to click on this link right here that says click on this link. This is gonna open up to your Microsoft account and we're going to log into the account that we want to import the notebook to. If you have not logged into this account before, it is best to go to OneNote.com and log into that account first, because if you have not created a notebook inside of OneNote.com, especially if you're a new user, it's going to create an error message where this little import button is not going to be highlighted for you. Once you've logged in, you click on the import button, and now you navigate to your computer, to your download folder, and you're gonna find these two folders again for the key to success planning system. We're going to choose either the Monday start date or the Sunday start date. In this case, I'm a Monday start person. We're going to choose this one. Do not open the folder and select any of the folders in here. Only select the root folder and then hit upload. At this time, you're gonna get a confirmation to upload files. The number of files will change based on the addition. So go ahead and hit upload. This process here may take a few minutes to upload your files. If you navigate back to our website, we can give you an idea based on the upload speed of your computer 
in a planning edition that you have, how long it should take. In most cases, it should not take more than five to 10 minutes. During your upload process, if you wanna check the status of it, you can start by going ahead into your downloads folder on your machine and right clicking on the folder that you use to upload to get an idea of the size of the file that we're uploading. In this case, this edition is 63 megabytes. From here, we can go into OneDrive account and scroll down to a folder called Documents. And then from there, you might wanna look into a folder called OneNote Notebooks. In this case, I'm uploading the folder right here in the root directory, 2023 Key Assess Business Planner. You can see it was uploaded a few minutes ago and it's at 33 megabytes. So that indicates that we're about halfway through the upload process. So we'll go back to the import window and continue to watch and allow that file to upload. All right, Achiever, you have successfully imported your notebook. We're going to start by clicking on View Notebook. And this is going to open up our OneDrive account and automatically it's going to open up OneNote.com and open up a notebook in your web browser. Now, for many of you, if you guys are looking to open this up on a tablet device, you can now go to OneNote.com, log into your account online, and then from the web browser, go ahead and click up here where it says editing and open in application. This will open the application on your device, such as an iPad or an Android tablet, and it'll open up the OneNote application on that device and open the notebook you do need to have the application installed. In this case, we are opening this up on a desktop. So we can go ahead and click on Open Desktop App and then confirm that we want to open Microsoft OneNote. Here it is opening OneNote and you can see that it already opened my 2023 Key to Success Planner. You are now ready to go. If you want to go ahead and open this up on additional devices, you're more than able to. Also, this is a good time to note, if you wanna go back to our website, scroll to the top and go under training resources, training support to training resources, you will be able to get a complete guide of all the training tools that we have. This library is full of information to help you learn how to use our planning system. So there's everything from tutorials on how to use the individual pages in our planner, as well as how to go ahead and use OneNote and other applications and other tools. Also a good time if you haven't already, go ahead and jump up to our YouTube channel, which you can find the link at the bottom of the page here. And by jumping over to YouTube, to our channel, you can see more enhanced videos. Go ahead and subscribe to our channel and get to know us on a personal level, as well as get to learn some master tips about how to use OneNote as well as other devices in our pro tips training playlist. Guys, again, thank you for ordering the Key to Success Planner. If you have any questions, go ahead and reach out to us and know that we also offer personal training. Have a great day and God bless each and every one of you.